Hey guys, Smart Ninja 0 here. Today we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, we're going to be doing a mod showcase. Um, now don't worry, it's not some random mod. It's actually it's a good one. I like it. Very nice. Pretty sure I'm one of the first people to actually ever do it, just because, you know, um, it's really new. It's still in beta or whatever. So it's got a whole bunch of new features. Uh, but first I should probably say what the mod is. It's Plex Mod. So this mod's called Plex Mod, and it's it's not like something like Pod Crash where it adds a whole bunch of new, crazy, complicated, radical things. It just adds a couple of nice mod features um, that you wouldn't normally get. It's obviously for Mindplex. I mean, it's called Plex Mod. So, anyways, uh, the way the mod works, it is allowed. I talked to uh, staff about it. Um, is uh. It's super cool. It all ha it starts with a base command, which is slash plex. And uh, right now I'm in uh, version 0 0.3. It's unreleased beta. You can still download it. Their Discord will be linked in the description of which you can download it there. So you have a whole bunch of different options. You have friend. Um, you have me chat or messaging, chat, auto thank, and Discord. So friends is a little bit glitchy. Um, I mean, it's still in beta, so we obviously, I'm not exactly sure what it does, but I know that a lot of the friends feature got fixed when Mindplex updated the friends. This was all for the chat friends, if I recall correctly. Um, at least that's what I was told. Uh, next you have messaging and what better reply is supposed to do is if you switch servers, it's supposed to allow you to slash R some like slash R someone. And there's a timeout. I'm not exactly sure if it does this perfectly. I haven't really tried this, but that's if I'm correct, that's what it's supposed to do. Chat is super nice. It's got the uh, player chat, party chat, team chat, um, community invites, ad blocking, and MPS. So player chat, that's just regular chat, party chat, obviously party chat, team chat, obviously team chat. Chat filter, what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to block things like Carl, etc., uh, just like when Carl says, hey, I have some rewards for you. Um, obviously, it's not going to be there. Um, and again, it's slash plex the command. Um, so I can go over real quick what the developer told me. So what level one does is level one blocks uh, treasure and Carl the creeper. And level two blocks stat manager. So it says like your stats been reloaded. That's what it does. It does stack up. So obviously if you're level two, it blocks Carl and treasure and stats. Level one obviously blocks just um, treasure and Carl. Now, um, MPS support, it's uh, the way MPS support works is pretty simple. Um, MPS support is no longer used. MPS used to have a different chat type, I think it was, something like that. Um, I asked about that as well. Ad blocking is supposed to block ads saying like, oh, ranks are 75% off. Auto thanks pretty, uh, pretty simple. It just automatically thanks. Now Discord is where it gets really cool. So here we are in my Discord. Um, it's kind of spammy. That's okay. Um, and you'll notice with the rich presence on it says playing Plex model, say in a lobby, which we are doing. We'll say what lobby we're in and my IGN. Now you can turn this off easily. Um, the, there's a timer as well, um, which does stuff. Obviously, we're not in a game, so that doesn't work. Um, that's why you wouldn't showing up. I recommend uh, you do have to have one of these on. You can't just show a timer. That doesn't work. Um, I recommend showing your IGN and not your server. Uh, remember, because if you have slash F, um, your semi-visible people, um, they can just check Discord. Now you can do slash plex help to get this nice list and this just tells you all the different commands. So all friend commands slash ff and plex friends are super glitchy and you just kind of want to ignore them. Again this is a beta, beta 0 0.3 so don't really worry about it too much. Uh, plex messaging uh, is pretty cool. But the where it says Plex and then something that's, I mean, it just opens up the the GUI for it. So all you have to do is really write slash Plex. Now the, the things that are really cool 
is DMs and RR. So here's a great example. Uh, slash RR, you write a partial username. And um, I've been messaging two people back and forth. So now it's, uh, I needed you to message me. So now I'll write super. Normally I'd have to write the full name out. I can just write a slash RR super. I could actually just probably write uh, like two characters too. And that's really nice. Um, coming right back. Mod showcase. Now slash DMs uh, pulls up this nice list where you can see uh, your DM history, who you've been messaging. You can then do uh, DM the person and you can see back and forth. So uh, he sent game, I said not yet, done with video. And there's that you can go uh, to different pages. So we can go to the start where he said, hey, I believe that's him saying, yeah, that's him saying, hey. I said, can I be in a call? And I'm like, no, I'm doing intro stuff. And then all that talking. You all know this. Uh, you haven't messaged anyone with their ID and matching test. It's recently. So it's you can't just search all players. It's all players recently you message. And that's about it for now. Um, 0 0.3 isn't super big. It's super cool, though. I mean, it's, it's just another mod, like an auto sprint mod or armor HUD mod. Uh, but it is still really awesome. I really love it personally. I think it's super great um, It's just a nice mod to use It's especially useful on mindplex. I mean that's kind of where it works uh, It's always being updated so you can join their discord link in the description That's where you'll be able to download it. You can also join my discord link in the description And you can join or you can follow me on Twitter as well. Uh, so that's that's the thing and I mean, there's not much else to really say about it. It's a super cool little mod. Um, I would not be surprised if they added a lot more to it. Uh, I think the developer's just trying to add features that other mods don't have. Um, so, honestly, I think it's pretty great. I love the way it works. You will also notice about the, um, the DMs is how it only takes up half of the screen, which is really great because a lot of people... Uh, like to put their chat size like the width I think it is down yeah and it works nicely with that so it the, they don't put too many of the little equal signs that make it look nice uh, which I think is just pretty great in general I mean it, it's just a great mod um, so yeah, you can download it I recommend downloading again it's technically not recommend, or it's technically not on the approved list, but um, but it's been reviewed by the rules committee. It's just not done, so that's probably why it's not on the rules. Again, this is the beta, so obviously some things will change. Uh, if you want an updated tutorial uh, for the next release, feel free to smash that like button. Leave a comment below if you enjoyed this and you want more mod showcases. Again, this just kind of relates to Mindplex, so I thought that would be kind of cool. It's a really awesome mod, and that's about it, folks. So, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in one. Bye.